Imagine a future where food and energy are produced in the same space by a system that can produce more crops per drop of water. It's in an urban area where food is needed the most and in an unexpected space, a space that typically goes unused. That future is here right now and it's a rooftop agrivoltaic system installed on the hydro building at Colorado State University's Spur Campus near downtown Denver, Colorado. I am Jennifer Busolo, a professor of horticulture and researcher at Colorado State University. Rooftop agrivoltaics means growing food on rooftops under solar panels. Two systems are working together in this space. An 18 inch deep green roof system with a solar panel array installed above it. Solar panels protect the plants from intense sunlight and extreme weather. And in return, the plants evaporatively cool the underside of the panels so they can operate more efficiently. The CSU Spur Rooftop Agrivoltaics system is unique. It is home to 102 solar panels. 51 of the panels are traditional silicon-based opaque panels, while the other 51 are silicon bifacial panels, meaning they have solar panels on both the upper and lower surfaces of the modules to absorb more reflected light. Each panel is two square meters, or just over 20 square feet. As researchers, my team and I are evaluating how plants respond to these growing conditions, how crops and ornamental plants tolerate the shade and weather protection of the solar panels. Plants we harvest for their foliage, like lettuce and other leafy greens, grow very well under the shade provided by the solar panels. For fruiting crops like chili peppers, flowering and fruit production are delayed. No matter what crops we test, the trends are clear. Plants use less water when grown under solar panels compared to plants grown in the full sun. We are growing food and capturing energy while conserving water, all on an underused space, rooftops. The future is now.